Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And, um, well, this week we're having a um, pretty big week with zero days of everybody fixing something. And it has to do in big part to something that a lot of software actually can process. And it's a um, image format called WebP. So I have an example of an image here. This is an official WebP image you could see here. It's ending .webp. Uh, what's that and why is it a problem? So this format, which was created by the uh, Google team, I believe, um, is a open format image. Now, what's interesting and the reason for its existence is how it can actually improve quality of images while limiting the size of the image. To give you an example, a high quality WebP image will be 20 to 30 to 40 percent smaller than a JPEG with the same quality. Um, it will be from 15 to 25 percent smaller than a PNG file, which are all image formats. So this is one of the image formats that Google would like you know to push because it is in fact much more efficient, smaller images to download from the internet, but higher quality at the same time. The problem resides in the fact that it has a flaw. And this is what it fixes when you update your browsers this week, because everybody's affected, even Firefox. When a specially crafted image exists, what happens is that it can create a heap buffer overflow. That means that when the file is writing to uh, memory, it can actually write a bigger file than it is allowed, which will actually be a problem. And this is where the zero day exists where it can be exploited and you could basically send a malicious webp file and that malicious file can then um, open the door to malware on the same page so what you would have is a web page that will send the specially crafted image and that will of course make the heap buffer overflow and in the same page you'll have code that will exploit that flaw. And that will, of course, um, make sure that your, your um, <clears throat> this will make your um, computer vulnerable. So um, basically, this is why everybody's going crazy because this is implemented in every browser. Every browser is capable of opening this file. And there are probably software out there, including software that are for uh, image processing that might actually have that flaw that needs to be fixed. So um, this is why everybody's going crazy because it's extremely easy to exploit uh, and that is the big problem this week. So that's what's happening with the WebP and the buffer overflow problem that everybody's going nuts. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.